What's going on guys? It's Omniarch and today I am bringing you the second edition of the Rise of Kingdoms legendary quiz series. Now, if you missed the first episode of this quiz series, that means you're not subscribed to Shinshi42. This series came as an idea from a conversation that I had with Shinshi, and I decided to record the first ever episode, send it to him, and have him react to it on his channel to see if he could get all of the questions right. So if you guys want to see the first ever episode, it is live on Shinshi's channel. Make sure you go down in the description below, click the link, head to his channel, watch that video, subscribe to his channel, all that good stuff. If this is the first ever episode that you're going to be watching of the legendary quiz series, let me quickly go over the rules for this video. So I'm going to be giving you guys 10 questions that are relevant to rise of kingdoms. You'll have 10 seconds to answer each of the questions. Now, if you want to play this video or do this quiz on easy mode, you can pause the video and take your time to answer the question correctly. However, I encourage you to only take 10 seconds to answer each of the questions. There will be a timer on screen. Additionally, obviously you cannot look up the answers to these questions on Google or check it out in game while you're playing this quiz. The third rule is that if you're a content creator and you're live streaming this reaction to this video, do not look at your chat for the answers. They probably want you to get it wrong anyway. And finally, keep track of the number of questions that you get right, because at the very end, there will be a scorecard and you'll be able to see exactly how well you know rise of kingdoms now in general these questions are going to get harder the further along the quiz that you go so try to get all the early ones right because they get really difficult near the end and with that being said guys let's jump right in the quiz with question one what is the highest tier of troop currently in the game The correct answer is, of course, tier five troops, the legendary T5 units. Question number two, who is the first epic commander you'll start with if you pick the Britain civilization? The correct answer is our girl, Boudicca. Question number three, there are two commanders who can only be obtained from VIP special privilege purchases. The first is Minamoto and the second is who? The correct answer is Hannibal Barca. Question number four, what is the name of the economic technology that increases your research speed? The correct answer is everyone's favorite subject in school, mathematics. Question number five, with all five skill points, what is the damage factor value of Cao Cao's active skill Dragon Rider. With five skill points invested in Cao Cao's first skill, his damage factor value is 1400. Question number six. There are two civilizations that buff March speed by 5%. One of them is Rome. Which is the other? The other civilization that buffs March speed is the Ottoman Empire. Question number seven, true or false? The prime minister title grants the user two buffs, one of which is a 10% building speed increase. The correct answer is of course true. Question number eight, which piece of equipment costs the most amount of raw gold in order to forge? The 
the correct answer is of course Skolas's lucky coin coming in at a massive 50 million gold in order to forge question number nine true or false the legendary commander Cleopatra has been in the game since its first initial release. The correct answer is false. Cleopatra was added in patch 1.07 in early September of 2018, yet somehow we still don't have an Egyptian civilization. Come on, Lilith, what's going on? Finally, question number 10. Joan of Arc's fourth skill increases normal attack damage by 25% when it has five skill points invested. However, this wasn't always the case. In an attempt to nerf Joan of Arc, this skill had to be changed. Originally, what did Joan of Arc's fourth skill do? Back in the day, Joan of Arc's fourth skill reduced damage taken by 25%. And bonus round. What is the name of the building most recently added into Rise of Kingdoms? The correct answer is of course the Lyceum of Wisdom, which just like this video will quiz you every single day. However, the questions in this video are actually things that you might know the answer to. Now make sure you guys tally up the number of questions that you got correct throughout the video and I will display on screen your grades for the second episode of the Legendary Quiz series. Make sure you comment down below letting me know what your score was for this episode as well. Comment below telling me what you currently think about the Lyceum of Wisdom and its associated quiz events. I personally find the midterms to be very difficult with the complexity of the questions as well as the short timer that you get in order to answer them. But of course, I just didn't really study that much history growing up so maybe that's my own fault i don't know again huge shout out to shinji 42 if you guys want to check out the first episode it will be linked in the description below and of course you'll be able to see how he does on the first ever episode so i encourage you guys to check that out if you've made it this far into the video hopefully you guys will drop a thumbs up on the video it really does help out my channel a ton and i really 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 do appreciate that consider subscribing for more content just like this and click that bell to be notified the next time that i upload new rise of kingdoms content as always my social media links will be in the description below including my discord channel where you can come and join ask me questions about rise of kingdoms and on top of that my twitch link is also in the description where i do go live every single week playing rise of kingdoms so if you drop a follow over there you'll be notified whenever i go live and you can come in and ask me questions about the game in real time and you won't have to wait for me to see your comment on my videos and finally thank you guys so much for watching i really do appreciate it this has been omniarch and i will talk to you guys again soon peace